Hello, I'm Eric Brooks with Alpine Electronics. In this video, we're gonna cover some selling features and things you should know about key products in the Alpine line. The products we're gonna to review today are the ILX W650, the newly released ILX407, and our PowerStack amplifiers. We're also gonna discuss Alpine's Halo subwoofer enclosures and run down the S-Series family of products. So let's get started. Okay, we released the ILX W650 a couple of years ago and it has been a consistent bestseller in the industry. This head unit has a 7 inch anti glare WVGA display with capacitive touchscreen. It supports Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, as well as Bluetooth phone and audio streaming. This unit also is Sirius XM and steering wheel control ready. The ILX W650 has two camera inputs, so you can easily add multiple drive assist cameras and control them from the screen. As far as video playback, you can do video on the USB input using AVI, MP4, MPG, MOV, and WMV formats. This unit has a cool two finger swipe interface that allows you to swipe the screen to quickly control volume up, volume down, skip forward and back, and pause functions. The ILX W650 has several things that make it a great sounding head unit. It has a 24 bit DAC, six channel time correction, selectable three band graphic or nine band parametric EQ. It has internal high pass and low pass crossovers with customizable frequency settings, slopes, and channel attenuation. I tell customers that this allows them to tell what sound to go to what speaker and adjust their levels to create great sound without distorting their system. The ILX W650 also has a built-in 16 watt by four amplifier and strong four volt preamp outputs for sending clean signal to external amps if you choose. This unit also has a shallow chassis that makes installation easy, giving more room behind the head unit for connections in the vehicle. But this shallow chassis has an even greater benefit when using an Alpine feature called PowerStack. PowerStack is the capability to mount Alpine's KTA 450 and KTA 200 amp amplifiers directly to the back of the head unit. I'll tell you more about these special amplifiers in a minute. But this PowerStack concept received a CES Innovation Award in 2019, which is really cool. The next product that I'm very excited to tell you about is the new ILX407. The ILX407 has many similar features to the ILX W650 like 7-inch WVGA capacitive touchscreen, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and Bluetooth. It's also Sirius XM and steering wheel control ready. It also has the two camera inputs and the same USB video playback capabilities. The ILX407 has many of the same great audio features as well, like 24-bit DAC, six channel time correction, internal high pass and low pass crossovers with customizable frequency settings, slopes, and channel attenuation. But the new features of this unit is really what I'm excited about. The ILX407 is iDatalink Maestro ready. So if you have a vehicle that's compatible, you can get additional vehicle information and control right from the screen of your head unit. It has one HDMI input and one HDMI output, and it has HD radio. You can also prioritize your three home screens with 29 available widgets, so you can quickly find the apps that you want to use. The ILX407 has that same shallow chassis as the W650, so you have lots of room for connections in the dash, but more importantly, it has that same power stack feature that allows you to mount either the KTA450 or the KTA200M amplifier to the back. So let me tell you what's so special about the KTA 450 and the KTA 200M, besides the fact that they can mount to the back of a radio. Both amps have a technology called Dynamic Peak Power. We call it DPP for short. This DPP allows amps to deliver double the power output in bursts. DPP also makes these amps extremely efficient, so you can use a much smaller power wire than traditional amps. In the case of the KTA 450, if your car has a 20 amp constant radio circuit, you can use the factory head unit power wire to power it. The KTA 450 is rated at 50 watts by four RMS, but with DPP, it will deliver a true 100 watt by four without clipping audio signal. The KTA 200M is rated at 200 watts RMS, but with DPP, this amp will provide, you guessed it, 400 watts of real power. So it's very special that you can mount these amps directly to the back of the ILX W650 and the ILX 407, but keep in mind that they come with feet that allow you to mount them anywhere. Now, the product I wanna cover next is the Alpine Halo subwoofers. These enclosures come in S and R series and in 10 and 12 inch versions. They take design cues from our Halo floating display head units with that sleek black front baffle and rich looking silver trim. 
but it doesn't stop there. These enclosures have some real sound advantages, like being designed to work at optimal frequency range of the Alpine subs that are in them. Our design team went over and beyond to make sure these things sound great and have great output. They have threaded screw inserts for the woofer mounting so that you can set the enclosure on any side and rotate the sub so the logo is facing up without damaging the wood that the sub mounts to. You'll get a solid coupling of the woofer to the box every time because of this extra feature our team added. There's also a beautiful Alpine logo recess mounted on the box that, that really adds a premium look too. So these halo enclosures are beautiful looking, but they also make great sound and great output. And because of their efficient ported design, the S-Series Halo enclosures have a power range that allow them to work very well with both the power stackable KTA200M or the SA60M 600W S-Series mono amplifier. Oh, and something else that makes these Halo enclosures unique is the fact that you can link two together to create a dual subwoofer enclosure. We have the ProLink brackets available for both 10 and 12 inch enclosures which comes with a beautiful port coupler bracket for the front and a steel plate bracket for the back. You mount these using the supplied hardware and now you've gone from a single subwoofer to a dual subwoofer system. Just add another amp and you're ready to go. Okay, let's wrap up our time by talking about the very popular, great sounding S-Series product line. The S-Series speaker line offers a wide range of speaker sizes to take advantage of many factory speaker openings in cars. But while they will fit in many factory openings, they offer features and technologies that give significant upgrade over factory sound. This makes S-Series a great tool for building a rockin' sound system. Something that sets these speakers apart from the crowd and give them great sound is CFRP cone material. CFRP stands for Carbon Fiber Reinforced Polymer. We use CFRP, which is a very lightweight, rigid material to give extra strength to areas of the cone that may need it. CFRP can handle lots of power without distorting in shape. So you can listen to your system loud and hear music, not the speaker. Another great technology we use is called Hammer Surround. Hammer, H-A-M-R, stands for High Amplitude Multi-Roll. This surround gives the speaker great control as it moves in and out. This control means the Alpine S-Series can deliver great mid-bass and great overall sound without distortion. All the S-Series speaker models utilize this feature, and we have S-Series speakers available in both coax and component configuration. So whatever type of system you're building and whatever the application is, we should have you covered. Finally, let's talk about the great Alpine S-Series amplifiers. We have a four channel, five channel, and mono amplifier in the S-Series family. The SA32F is a 50 watt by four class D amplifier. This amp has great signal to noise ratio and very low distortion, which means this amp won't get in the way of you making great sound. It also has a thermal protection circuit that is useful if you drive your amp really hard for a long time. Some amps, when they get hot and need to cool, will just shut down, not Alpine S series. If you're cranking on your SA32F for a long time and it needs to cool down, it will slightly decrease the output until it cools so you'll never miss a beat of the music. The SA55V is a great full system five channel amp. You can use its powerful 40 watts by four channel and 300 watt mono to run an entire system using the same great features found in the SA32F. Oh, and you can use a remote bass knob, the RUX knob point two, to easily adjust your sub level on the fly. You'll have great sound in an amp that can play all day. Finally, the SA60M. This amp is a beast. It gives a true 600 watts of output with low distortion and great thermal protection. But the SA60M also has a damping factor of over a thousand. Damping factor is the ability to stop and start the woofer's motion quickly, helping it to create accurate and clean sound. The SA60M's damping factor is better than many other amps on the market, which is a huge reason why so many people like it and why we are so proud of it. The SA60M can also be controlled with the RUX knob 2 for that quick sub-level control. Something all of the S-Series amps have in common is the ability to take high-level input using RCA to speaker wire adapters. So whether you're sending a great 4-volt signal from an ILX W650 or ILX407 or running off a head unit without RCA outputs, these amps will work for you and they're a great way to build a great system. Well, thanks for the time and for listening about these products that we're very excited to share with you. I hope that you found the information useful and good luck selling Alpine in the future. 
Make sure to follow me on Instagram and Facebook at Alpine Brooks to keep updated on what we have coming from Alpine.